morning everybody happy sunday today is sunday the 31st i want to say it is the last day of this <sighs> march march has not been good for me other than my mom visiting uh and my nephew other than that march has not been my month Ma march i thought it came into it as a positive month but it actually turned out a little bit too you know like mm, not my month kind of thing like, not my time, not my month, you know what I mean? We, we all go through those vibes where, like, this isn't my day or this isn't my month. And for me, it was that that was the case. But I'm so glad we're starting into April. I have good vibes for April. At least I tell myself April is a good time for me. Um, not only because it's my son's birthday. My son's birthday is on April 11th. It is also my in-laws, my mother-in-law and father-in-law's birthday. Not just for me, but for my family, my kids, you know, everything's going to be great. So yeah, you guys, right now I'm doing dishes. What I got going on, got some dirty dishes in the sink. I got, this is pretty much washed. It's just not clean, but it is rinsed out. So I am going to have um, these dishes uh, put away in the dishwasher. But right now I have the dishwasher running so that it can just disinfect. Sorry about that. If you hear anything loud, it's the dryer. I have clothing. But yeah, my husband interrupted my video. How rude. Just kidding. Now, um, he called me and he just wanted to tell me that he's on his way back into the house. He went to ride bicycles with Jesse. But back to what I was saying, guys. Yeah, I, I figured since, you know, I got this from Sam's right there. I figured, you know what? I'm just going to make everything red. But then I figured since I have this that my mom gifted me, it might as well. And then the, the blue, t green towel or blue. What am I saying green? Turquoise. And then just seeing the flowers that my husband got me last Sunday, they're dying. But yeah, um, seeing all that, I was like, you know what? I just want my kitchen to be colorful. So I also got this from, from Target for a dollar. So I figured, you know what? Everything seems to, even my calendar, I'm sure you, sorry, that was my hand. It's all, you know, colorful. I got pink magnets, things like that. So I, I just figured, you know, just get a, a teal color or turquoise, um, turquoise Keurig, it doesn't matter because everything in your kitchen is colorful. So I was like, you know what, I'm going to go with it. I'm going to roll with it. The kitchen is going to be colorful. That's just the way it's going to be. I'm not picky either. I, I love seeing colorful kitchens because it just makes me feel like I can be creative in the kitchen, cook whatever I want. So I just, it, it's just the most, um, this is the most looked at room when we get guests over. Uh, people come over visiting whatever it is um, the first thing you see is the kitchen because you walk in and you to the left is the kitchen it's open and there's another entryway right there all right you scared me oh my god i heard something over there and then i saw the door open I'm like what so yeah um that's why you know i figured it's like the one room where everybody sees so i wanted it to be colorful yeah anyways <laughs> there's Baby, see how like I have to hold it and then you can't see me, but you can see him. Yeah. And then you can see me, but you can't see him. <laughs> I love you. I love you too. All right, but yeah, I was just explaining to them about the kitchen, how colorful it is, and mm -hmm. that we love it. Of course. That it's colorful because we get to come in here and feel like it's, I don't know, it's just like cheerful. Yeah, I, I love I love the kitchen. My wife always she always makes it very colorful, like. When you walk inside, it's not bland. It's always yeah. It's not one color. It cheers you up. And yes, Papa. And I as well. And I go right outside with the egg, and then mm -hmm. I won. You won. Yeah, he beat me. Oh wow. I put I put Aaron in his tire on his bike, mm -hmm. and then he just took off, and I was like, oh my god. <laughs> yeah, they were riding bicycles, like I said earlier. Oh, my phone's about to. Wait, no, it's not. It's too quick. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys go. Today we are going to go out and buy groceries, buy laundry soap. Things that we need, I'll vlog with you in a little bit. Um, my eyebrows. But yeah, I got laundry going on. Oh, also I did order more books for Jesse. I think I tell you guys every time when I order. We went ahead and ordered some more books. And Jesse's been so into Hammerhead Sharks that we ordered a few Hammerhead Shark books and Shark books. And they talk about tooth, like losing your teeth when you're a kid. And also lost and found, things like that. So things that I would teach the kids, obviously. We don't just buy books that are like cute and all. They have to have some kind of meaning, meaning to it. Yeah, manners, um, morals, things like that. 
I'm so glad to be doing videos for you guys. I, I love it so much. Um, I think it, it's all about the person, the personality and stuff, you know. Be happy for other people as well, you know. If they're doing great, be happy. If they're not doing so good, oh. keep supporting them. Don't put them down because that's just not a good vibe, you know. It's not, it's not going to bring you a positive to towards exactly. yourself. If you, if y'all are, if you're upset that your channel, like my channel, my channel's not oh. that big. My channel, I have 103 subscribers, and it's been like that for the past year, but... Well, you, you, you also, know. um, you've been posting, but then at the same time, he's been busy with work, too. Exactly. So, but he always, he's not going to abandon the channel, right? You're no, gonna I'm not. Mo's going to do it. It's just, you know, um, like with me, I just keep positive and keep thinking that, okay, well, eventually I'll catch on, you know what I mean? Yeah. Right now. Yes, so girl. yeah, okay, you'll have a bottle. But yeah, just just a little reminder, you know, everybody. I've been there years ago. Years ago, I did a video about that. Hammerhead shark. That he did. Thank you for sharing, Jesse. Here, Audrey. But yeah, um, everybody, you know, we gotta feel good about. We gotta feel good about each other. Support each other here because. That's what I've been doing, you know, I'm never gonna forget about YouTube, like how I started it. To me, it's just a hobby. I don't feel forced to do anything. I don't feel like I have to please everybody. So please don't feel that way, that you have to please people because you're doing a channel. Do, do you, do yourself, and, you, do you, you know. Boo. Yeah, you do boo, you, boo. Um, just do yourself, you know, do what you love and things will fall into place. That's all the advice I have for those of you who have felt down. I've been there, trust me, I know, and I still feel that way sometimes. But you know what? Keep doing what you love and you will get out there. Hey, I don't know how well you can see me, but I am here super, super duper. Hold on. Let's go ahead and... Super duper excited for today. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. Um, just got back from shopping, shopping around. I'm so excited. So I got my Mega Kors and without thinking that I was going to go get something. All right, anyways. Also got some Panda Express egg rolls. A little frustrations going on there because these people obviously didn't, they did not do their order right. I'm not trying to be a pest here, but I did complain to the like the lady charged charged me the wrong thing, and when she gave me the receipt at the window, I checked just to make sure, and I confronted her about it. And I said nicely, you know, you you charged me extra for um, egg egg rolls, and I didn't want extra egg rolls. And then she said. Oh, it's the same thing as the uh, ragoons or whatever my husband got. And yeah, the point she said it's fine. They're going to bring him out. And we parked in the front. And by the time I got all the food, um, I was charged extra. So we're going to get credit. I got the receipt. And the manager spoke to me. He said that he's going to go ahead and just go ahead and give me a free plate because of the overcharged egg roll. So that worked out for us. But yeah, that was that. And I got the Panda Express. We're going to go back out to GameStop, or I might just let my husband go to GameStop and just, you know, let him, not let him, but, you know, he can go on on his own. I already went shopping, got myself this beautiful Michael Kors bag, you guys. So I was telling you right now that I, I'm obsessed with Michael Kors, okay? Michael Kors is, this one's the one my husband got me from the PX here in Fort Bliss. This was our first year, I believe, here, and he bought me this for Mother's Day when I was in Houston visiting. He sent me pictures and said, Happy Mother's Day, because I was not here for Mother's Day. But he went and bought me, he surprised me with it. I couldn't wait. He asked me, do you want to be surprised or do you want to come home and, and be surprised? Or do you want me to tell you what your surprise is? It was so sweet of him, I remember. And then this time around, I saw this one and I was like, oh my god, I've been wanting it. So, my favorite of the Michael Kors, I love their, their um, you know, like signature print. I love it, because it's like a... This kind of sound. I just love it because you can easily clean it and stuff. It is absolutely beautiful. I love it. And I cannot stress enough how much I love this purse. I can tell you guys, not stress it. Tell you guys how much I love this purse. And I love the pocket that's kind of deep right here where I can put my phone. Let's see. Yeah, I could fit my phone in here. And I can easily just throw my card in here. And this says Michael Kors. It's beautiful. Um, you guys know. There's the price on there. Look at how beautiful it is. And I also forgot to mention that I picked up some Gogla. Similar, but these are the ones that I picked up. And they just look like that. They're very cute. So I cannot wait to try these on. And also, because I've been wanting to wear falsies for a while. I'm going to go to Walmart and pick up my highlighting kit. Because I don't know if you guys noticed. I did. Let me. This way. 
I did dye my hair. I did um, end up doing a lighter brown all over my roots and everything. So all I'm going to be doing now is putting in some highlights because my hair is already, as you guys can see, it's pretty light. But I'm going to do it lighter. So I'm going to go like all over effect this time and make it blonde looking. Um, I do have some hair dye, so I'm not sure if I should just go ahead and do the hair dye first. And then go ahead and do the highlight because the hi once the highlights are in, you can't undo that unless you completely cover it one color. Mommy, but I'm hungry. It's going to be a little hard. Hold on, sweetheart. Um, I already gave you. So it's sometimes, hold on. Like I was saying, guys, if for any reason I do go uh, with highlights, I can't um, touch it anymore because it's already done and there's just no way I'm going to mess it up. I do my hair at home. I don't trust anyone with my hair it's just my thing you know i just don't trust people with my hair the reason being is because if anybody uh were to oh my px bag and the panda express bam um if i do they might mess it up or something and i don't want that so it's really hard for me to find some somebody to trust to do my hair so got some this is a palette i didn't even get, pick this like i didn't even get what it was exactly but i i just saw Dulce's face on this, like her name, Dulce Candy. Guys, I've talked about her before when I used to do, I had a, a little makeup channel. Um, my old channel, I learned about Dulce Candy. I love Dulce Candy. I always follow up her tutorials, hair tutorials, things like that. And since she was in the army, you guys, she was my go, my OG YouTuber. This, if you guys don't know who she is, you need to get on. It's in... I don't know, these are eyeshadows. They're either eyeshadows or all over thing because the packaging. Hmm. It says bring out your natural beauty and enlight enliven your complexion lids and cheeks with this multi-use palette so i was right it's a multi-purpose use i love multi-purpose use palettes because it has lots of colors you guys and i think i'm gonna do a video specifically on this one just to show you because i don't even know if you can get this anymore or where you can get this but look at I'm trying to show you guys the colors mm. So I hope you guys enjoyed this weekend. I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Love you guys. Bye.